Okay, we're going to need, um, for our bank simulation and any other simulations that we do, we need random numbers and we need a pardon me, random number generator and we need random numbers in different distributions. Uh, for our bank simulator, we use the normal distribution and the Poisson distribution. Remember, for Monopoly, we only use the normal distribution. <clears throat> so for our bank simulator, uh, I've given you a class, RNG, random number generator, and it's a static class. That means everything in it, all the fields, all the properties, and all the methods are static. We have a random object, which is in the .NET framework, so we're just using it. We don't have a normal distribution, uh, and .NET framework does not give us a Poisson distribution. You can see I've uh, written my own Poisson distribution using the famous algorithm from Donald Knuth. You can Google and find uh, all kinds of documentation about that. He's a well-known computer science professor, and he wrote many books on algorithms. Be a good idea to have uh, his his algorithm book in your library. So, anyways, we need uh, a normal distribution still, and we're going to get that by downloading and installing a uh, a library that contains a lot of uh, mathematical functions called Meta Numerics. So, if you just Google Meta Numerics. You'll find it's hosted by uh, the CodePlex, which hosts many open source projects. Click on download, and I'm going to go ahead and just install it right from the browser. All right, and we'll install it for everyone in any normal place. Yes. Okay, so that's installed. Now let's go back and look at our project and see. I uh, it's still underlined because I need to add a reference. Okay, it's going to be in extensions because it's an extension. It's not part of not. It's not part of .NET. It's an extension. And there it is, Meta Numerics. I'll go ahead and tick it to add it and say OK. And the red squiggles go away. And I can build and everything builds fine, including my random number generator class. So there we have it. You, in order to get your normal distribution, you're going to download MetaNumerics. And MetaNumerics is a, a library that provides all kinds of extras. It's a good idea to have a look at that if you have any mathematical uh, needs. <clears throat> Anyways, we download it. And then the other thing we have to do, we have to have using statements, mentioning the things that we're using from that library. And we have to add a reference to the library, MetaNumerics, so that our solution knows that it has to link to this other uh, assembly in order to access those methods that uh, live in that other assembly.